Thanks, well, it's lovely to be invited down to Rokeby Neighbourhood Centre and just see what they've been doing through the COVID-19 issues. Um, they've been open, they've been supporting their neighbourhoods uh, in such brilliant ways. And one of the ways they decided to do that was to have a photo competition to help keep people engaged in the community, to give them something different to do. They've, I know they've had hundreds of um, photos sent in and every few weeks they've had some people decide who the winners are for that time and today I'm the lucky person that gets to do that. But I also know, because this is one of my very favourite um, neighbourhood centres to visit, what great other work they've done out there in the community. They've delivered hampers and they've delivered food to people as well uh, and they've delivered isolation packs that they've made up. So. Big, big thank you to the um, Kate and all the staff here at the Rokeby Neighbourhood Centre. Brilliant thing to do to keep your community engaged. It's been a hard time for everybody, uh, but certainly for those people that have felt isolated and maybe not been able to get out and meet and greet and be with people they wanted to be with. But as I said, today I've been asked to judge this week's photo competition and I've I'm lucky because I get to choose two and it's always hard when you're asked to do something like this because there's some brilliant photos and I've seen other ones, not just today's, but other ones from this competition and there's been some very, very good photos there. But the two I've chosen this week are, because I think we all need a little bit of colour in our life and I think this is a really cheery, heartwarming photo um, I've chosen these beautiful flowers, not sure what type they are because I'm not a very good gardener, but I do think this one is very heartwarming, especially on a cold, chilly day like we're having at the moment here in Hobart. Yeah. And the second one I chose was this little one that to me just looks like mischief. I think this little person might be a bit of a mischief maker. Um, and but what a lovely photo for when they've grown up for the 18th or 21st birthday party in fact i think um and just showing you know the kids can have fun with anything it looks like a bowl of flour so kids can have fun with sort of anything around the house and obviously this little person has so congratulations to both of those photographers for great photos and thanks once again huge thanks once again to the Rokeby Neighbourhood House and all the volunteers and staff that have kept it running and done such a great job through COVID-19.